so I actually built the perfect laptop gaming setup. And what I mean by that is this setup literally has all the necessities you need, which come at a pretty cheap price as well. So starting off with the mono, I actually bought it from Amazon, and this mono is actually really cheap. I only pay like $110 for it. And the packaging is pretty nice as well. I mean, really easy to unbox. Considering this is a preach mono, I wouldn't expect too much features on it, which I was right. I mean, it doesn't have an adjusting button, so you don't have the option to play with the settings and all that stuff. But I mostly bought a mono because when you connect it to a laptop, it actually increases the FPS. So this is the mono 144Hz. I don't know the name of it, but it should be somewhere on the screen. And the mouse pad is actually from Kraken. They sponsored me in the past and I really like it. Obviously my main mouse, which I'd recommend to anyone. I'm actually gonna put the name on the screen because I don't remember it. I know it's a collaboration with AimLab. As for the keyboard, it's from Asus as well. And it's literally the best keyboard I have at the moment. It genuinely feels nice. Lots of colorway options and it has no delay. If you wanna get something that will last you long, you should literally get this headset. I mean, I had it for like a year now and I literally had no problems with it. All of this I would say is top quality stuff. So I definitely recommend it. As for the laptop, it's a classic Nitro 5. I'll get into the details later on when I actually show you the FPS, the components, the price, and everything it has to offer. But again, everyone knows that it doesn't disappoint. So the chair I have is actually from Noble Chairs, which I have for some time now. And let me tell you, the armrest is fully customizable. As you can see, they move up and down sideways, which adds to the comfort as you can literally adjust it to the height of your desk. The quality and premium feeling of the chair really makes it worth buying. You can adjust the height of the chair and the lumbar support. It has two foam pillows which you can rest your head and your back as well. The level and full support of this chair really lasts you a long time, along with helping you maintain a good posture. So it's definitely a good investment. You can choose from the variety of chairs in order to fit your needs, which is great. They can ship these chairs anywhere in the world and I definitely recommend buying one. The link is in the description. And this is pretty much the finished version of it. And now we're actually gonna try to play on it. Now paired with this monitor, the laptop's actually holding an impressive 500 to even 600 FPS in creative. And the components are pretty decent as well, as you can see on the screen. Overall, I think this laptop actually goes above and beyond its limit. Holding 500 FPS in creative, it's insane to me. And as I said, the laptop, the setup complements each other perfectly. The money works great as well, as it definitely helps boost the FPS of the laptop. And if you guys want more videos of this setup, just let me know and I'll deliver. In competitive in Arena, I actually cap my FPS to 160 and it seems to be holding pretty well. I mean, no single job. And they're definitely a really good laptop that actually can maintain consistent FPS unlike other laptops. This laptop actually costs around $800, which I think is pretty cheap for what it can do. You can expect to have good gameplay on it. I mean, I even have other apps open and it doesn't seem to impact it at all. And if you wanna build a nice laptop setup, this would definitely be it, even in fights. As you can see, I'm on 160 FPS and it doesn't seem to have a problem holding it. It's is super consistent, but I am gonna say that it does make some noise. I mean, you can literally hear it. To be honest, if you're actually wearing headphones, it wouldn't even impact you, but yeah, it definitely makes some noise. I might have to buy a laptop cooler for that. And as you can see, I'm pretty bad at game. I haven't played in a long time. I don't even know what's going on. This guy literally seems like an, like an AI. But I don't even know if that's possible. Like, cause there's no arena. This is called Rant or something like that. And he was actually so persistent, so I think he was real. So I literally heard someone. Wait. I mean, I ain't much better in 1v1s though, because it's mostly like a 1 on 1 and you're not gonna get killed by someone else, so it makes it a lot easier. And this guy's super bad. But I mean, if I actually try that, I could actually get good again. I'm like super washed. I'm just lucky that this guy is pretty bad. This laptop setup is actually really great, even though I prefer mine. 
this one is still as good, I think. And I want to say that if you want to buy a laptop, make sure you're actually going to use it like correctly, not only for gaming, because for gaming, you just get a PC. But if you do get a laptop, make sure you use it to the fullest, because obviously it's portable and you can do your work a lot easier on it. So yeah, make sure you use all the features of a laptop.